So you are a gifted teacher, energy healer, spiritual messenger, or coach, yet you get really bogged down with all the techie stuff and that keeps you from sharing your message and your gift with the world. So you are a gifted teacher, energy healer, spiritual messenger, or coach, yet you get really bogged down with all the techie stuff and that keeps you from sharing your message and your gift with the world. So I wanted to speak to this today because it does cause a lot of frustrations with some of my students and clients uh, when they find me that they are really bogged down with technology. And I get it, you're an energy healer, you're a spiritual teacher, you're a light worker, you're a coach, but you don't have a lot of background in building a virtual business. So what I wanted to share with you first is oftentimes I do see tech frustrations as an ego form of self-sabotage because you really, it's the ego's way to sort of keep you stuck in all of the minute details, really trying to figure something out, sort of stuck on shine, what I call shiny object syndrome, trying to figure out all the different ways that you might be able to piece your business together. You might find yourself watching webinar after webinar after webinar um, to try to figure out the best solution to how to grow your business. And I get that, right? Because again, this is not your, this is not your forte. This is not what you specialize in. But I wanted to share with you if it's even if it it's not a form of sabotage and it's just a legit, um, you know, lack of clarity around how to use technology, and you think that it's going to be this big can of worms. I can share with you that it's not. It's actually very very simple. You know, when I first started my business um, and first started even putting my message out online, when I think about that, um, I built my own, my first virtual assistant business from scratch. I had to learn HTML code. I had to do all these things. You don't have to do that now. It's all prepackaged for you. Those are one-stop shop solutions available to you now where you don't have to learn any of that stuff. What I can say is that you may be thinking that you have to have like all of this overhead with technology in order to start your business. And I can say, this is absolutely a myth that I wanna bust, that this is not true. So the formula that I teach inside um, Sacred Leader Academy is the same formula that I used to build out Sacred Leader Academy. And when I launched Sacred Leader Academy, for example, this was over the COVID quarantine, and I launched it on about $90 worth of monthly software. And it brought in five figures just in pre-sale alone, just before there was any content created, before there, you know, there was even a sales page. So technology was very, very limited. I literally, like $90 a month was the software I used to launch a six-figure, now moving closer to, it'll be on track to be a multiple six-figure business very, very soon. So it doesn't take a lot of overhead to launch your business. It does require that you're in alignment and that you're showing up online and that you're, you're being seen and found and heard by your ideal soulmate clients. But that's another video. I just wanted to share with you that it is totally 100% possible to start your business on a shoestring budget. And I think back to when I started, you know, my one of my my brick and mortar business. You know, I've had service based businesses, I've had brick and mortar businesses, I've had virtual businesses. And I remember when I started my organic spray tanning studio that cost thousands of dollars to build out the studio to invest in you know paint and carpet and sinks and furniture and walls and all of these things thousands of thousands of dollars to build out a space before i ever had a client before anybody could pay me before there was anybody walking through the door before there was any marketing before there were any testimonials before there was any social proof nothing and I just wanna share with you that that is not the case when building a spiritual business online. And literally all your clients are on social media and online right now, and your smartphone is a portal to like the entire planet, and you can get your message and your gift out to people worldwide on a global level right now through your iPhone, right? Like 90% of my business is run through my iPhone. All of these, um, 
all of these videos that you're watching right now for my sake, my Soul Line Success Series, they're all on my iPhone. Um, literally, it could not be easier to get your message out and start your business online. And it could not be more affordable. It could not be more cost effective. And your ROI can, is huge if you know how to align with, you know, the message that you're truly here to share, your gift, and, and, and get behind it confidently and know what it is that you're here to offer and know how to package that in a way. Now, as far as getting back to the techie stuff, there is tech involved, but it's minimal. And so if that is the excuse that's holding you up, that is just the excuse that's holding you up. 